Choosing the perfect name for a property can be tricky, but whoever gave Mansion House its name went straight to the point. This five-storey, 11,075 square foot building has a 50-foot wide facade and towering columns on either side of its front door. But although the property is 112 years old, it has never actually been a house. But now, after a background as a company headquarters and a political command post, it has been converted into a seven-bedroom home, listed for about $45.6 million. Luxury developer Seigal DDC's renovation has concentrated on restoring the property's original features. With lashings of Calcasaroro marble and parquet flooring and chandeliers lighting vaulted ceilings, Mansion House is an exercise in old-school grandeur. A lavish cupola lights the stairs, a glass dome decorated with a confection of plaster scrolls and flowers, plus gold leaf. Mansion House's price tag includes all its furniture and fittings, down to the artwork. As well as seven bedrooms and seven bathrooms, the house has space for a dining room, formal and informal living rooms, a media room, wine room and staff quarters. The basement features a swimming pool tiled in a glitter of gold, green and bronze mosaic tiles, as well as a hot tub and a sauna. But perhaps Mansion House's best feature is its outside space, a walled backyard filled with climbing plants and planters and a roof terrace, with views of the Houses of Parliament and the peak of Big Ben. Alistair Nicholson, one of Mansion House's two selling agents, is hopeful that sterling will start to recover. If the pound starts to go up, it will force hands, he said. At the moment, people are trying to call the bottom of the currency market rather than the bottom of the property market. <laughs>